Life like a wayfarer journeying Like a stranger on his way back And the Prophet وسلم, said, I will wait by the Sirat, by the bridge, and just in case any one of my followers struggles to cross the bridge. Now look at the Rahmat of Rasulullah Look at his concern for the Ummah. And, the, and today the Ummah doesn't care. And the first thing most people do when they rise in the morning, on the day of Qiyamat, on a very severe day, the Prophet wants to wait for his Ummah by the pond and then by the scale and then by the sirat and the first thing majority of the muslims do when they rise in the morning first thing they say bismillah allahu akbar and they pour it down the gutter and they have no shame this is the sunnah of muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam never even once did the beloved prophet of allah allow a razor to come anywhere near his noble face and this is what a Muslim does now. He wants to look like a peeled potato. Like a peeled potato, mashallah. Abbas log, sab yam bhi sab saaf, upar bhi sab saaf, everything is plain. It's become fashion nowadays uh, to have a bold head. In the olden days, people used to be embarrassed. If they had a bold head, they'll be embarrassed. But now, uh, it's fashion, uh, tend. Uh, everything bold here and bold there and like a totally peeled potato. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. Sunnat of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Sunnat of all the prophets. Sunnat of all the sahaba. All the awliya. Majority of the ulama. And now we are living in times of fitr and fasad. Such a fitr many even ulama shave. Oh, in Egypt and other places, oh, yeah. mashallah, you'll be, you'll, be, you'll be lucky to find in many countries ulama with beards even now. <laughs> yes, this is, uh, this is, Allah, this is such a beloved sunnah of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And this sunnah, uh, this is your security and assurance against shaitan and sin in many a cases. Uh, if you're walking down the street and you, you're holding hand with a woman, you'll think twice. She might even be your wife. But you, but you don't want to be seen, somebody saying, Maulana has got no shame. Look, he's walking on the Broadway man with a woman. <laughs> She's his wife. But, uh, but you won't be walking, mashallah, you know, uh, holding even your wife's hand, mashallah. It'll teach you decency. Uh, when the new film comes out, uh, if you've got a beard, mashallah, everybody else is waiting in the queue. But if somebody wants to go and watch the latest Harry Potter, <laughs> he'll look around ten times, he'll be looking around constantly, he don't want to be seen, spotted here. <laughs> uh, waiting to get into a nightclub or a casino, if you got this, Allahu Akbar. <laughs> That's the last place you want to be seen. Uh, so this is your assurance against shaitan, it will save you from a thousand and one sins. I was saying, if you want to keep it, keep it here. Because in Jannah, may Allah take us all there, there will be no beard. Uh, this is your place, mashallah. If you want to keep it, this is the place to have it. Because in Jannah, those who've done well here, and they've kept it, let it lose, then Allah will give them a nice clean shave. They'll be, they, mashallah, they will be, their skin will be so soft and smooth. Allahu Akbar. There'll be no hair, uh, except the hair on your head, mashallah, which make you look good. Uh, you'll be, you want to look smart, that's the place to look smart. Uh, not here. Here is a place, mashallah. Here if you want to look smart, your smartness is in looking like Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And the Prophet will make shafaat for those who follow the sunnah of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, especially so. Allahu Akbar.